Welcome back. The National Park Service crowning the city of Foley as the American World War II heritage city in the state for Alabama. Fox News and Ias Braggs was at City Hall today and found out only 11 communities in the entire country have been designated as American World War II heritage cities. In a momentous celebration of history and hometown pride, Foley has been named the American World War II heritage city for the state of Alabama by the National Park Service. Mayor Ralph Helmick says he was elated to receive the distinction. Oh, this is an incredible honor. And of course, I'm the mayor and I get to represent my 25,000 people. But this has been going on for a long time. Our city has historically always been very patriotic. Mayor Helmick shared the National Park Service started a program within the last year looking for cities in the country that supported the World War II effort. Guy Busby, Foley's marketing slash communications manager, played a key role in this effort. He shared more about what role the city of Foley played during World War II, which dates back to 1942, when the Barron Field opened in the area. It opened on December 5, 1942, so almost a year, exactly a year after Pearl Harbor. In the first two years, they trained almost 5,800 cadets or aviators out there. By 1945, you had, you had 2,000 officers and enlisted personnel assigned to Barron Field. Looking ahead, Foley is determined to share its rich history. We are going to make sure that the folks that either come and visit Foley or live here uh, know the history of our city. Uh, right now, our museum director uh, are working on a permanent display, which has been in the works before this, uh, to uh, acknowledge our interaction with the U.S. Navy and the training of naval aviators uh, at our museum here in Foley. So it's a wonderful, wonderful honor for Foley and for everybody who did all their, did their part back then and still is still doing it today to recognize, uh, recognize people's service. Anaya Spraggs, Fox 10 News.